Hey Cards fans, Barry K with Cards for Days, and I know it's not Wednesday, but it's been a while since I've done a Fairfield box opening. This will be a nice short video where I just take a look at these. I picked up a bunch of these, uh, and I haven't opened them in a while, so I really enjoy these just because they're uh, fairly cheap and you get a good variety. So here's what I saw on the cover. I'm not even sure who that is. Phillies. Is that Jimmy Rollins? Don't really know, but let's go ahead and rip this open and see who we find. I know uh, I've seen a lot of different boxes, like the pack hit boxes. These are the more just random baseball card boxes. The packs that I've been finding in these style uh, tend to just be some junk wax uh, cards. But I think it's a lot of fun to open these, and I was right. So our pack is... 1990 Fleer. So let's just, uh, we'll save that till the end and let's see what cards we get. So, right on, that was a Jimmy Rollins NL Most Valuable Player. And we got a lot of score. I've noticed a lot of score in these. Don August, Danny Heap, 90 score, Cecil Espy, there's a Dave Parker, Terry Leach, tons of 90 score, Fernando Valenzuela. A Mark Thurmond, Steve Davis, and 89 Fleer, Kevin Romin, back to 90 score, Mike Moore, tons of score, Tommy Gregg, Mike Sosha, Dave Val Valley, there's a Manny Trio, John Candelaria, 88 tops, I think that's 88, it is Tommy Gregg, 90 score. Then a turn back the clock. I was never a fan of these when I was a kid. And then another Kevin Romin. And here we go, 91 Donruss, the rookies, Frank Castillo. Back to 90 score. This is probably the worst in terms of variation that I've seen from these boxes. Junior Ortiz, Kurt Young, Mike Easler, DH. And then that cut is bad. That's... 86 Fleer. Gino Petrali. Back to 86 Fleer. Ted Simmons. Darnell Coles. Rick Ownby. <clears throat> uh, Wayne Tolleson. Back to 90 score. So much of it. Todd Stottlemyre. Geronimo Barroa. Lance Blankenship. Ed Correa. It's like 90 score and 86 Fleer. Al Newman. This might be the Fairfield box that changes my mind about how much fun they are. Now we're to 89 score. Jesse Barfield. Dave LaPointe. Jack Clark. We have not seen anything good. We've got a Rick Aguilera. Top Stadium Club. Now that's cool. I haven't seen this year. What is that? Um, 97. Top Stadium Club. First time I've seen that product. Dave Burba, same thing. Really nice. Almost has a like a chrome look to it. All right, let's see what we got. Delino de Shields, two thousand tops. I've not seen any of that. Pretty cool. Jeff Supon. Then we got Freddie Garcia. I like this version of tops. Nice and clean. Jeremy Reed. Jason Fraser, we got a Arthur Rhodes Diamond Skills Minor League, not seen that, Bobby Bonilla All-Star Game, Scott Servais, Mike Humphreys, and Brian Giles, alright, let's see if we can find uh, some more 90 score is what it looks like, just tons of score. I mean, nothing but score. Alan Anderson, this is the worst. Chili Davis, Rick Aguilera, Marvell Wynn, Darren Jackson, Curtis Wilkerson, Lonnie Smith, Harold Reynolds, Kirk Gibson, there's Kevin Seitzer, huge prospect when I was collecting. And then we get some 87 tops here, but some no names. Tom Gordon score. Andy Allenson, gold cup from 87 tops. Reggie Williams. 
Tim Wallach, Pete O'Brien, and then it's all creased right there. Don't know where they get their cards from. Kelly Gruber. Man, this is 90 score. Mike Smithson. There's a Bo Jackson 90 score. It's our first decent card. I mean, it's a, it's a Bo Jackson. Felix Jose. Dave Concepcion. Ron Hassey. Scott Ger Gerritz. Phil Garner, 87 tops. Now we've got tons of it. Benny DeStefano. Dick Sheffield. Juan Augusta. Floyd Rayford. Al Newman. Ron Karkovic. Off-centered. Rick Yett. Dave Gumbert. Charlie Huff. It's hardly a... If that were a lot older, it might be interesting, but... Not from 87. Willie Randolph. Doug DeCenzo. David Cohn. Is that a rookie? Nope. I think his rookie was 88. Keith Atherton. Bob McClure. Jeff Ballard. Or Ballard. Ernie Witt. There's a Dennis Eckersley from 89 Fleer. It's off-centered left to right. Let's see... Not too long after he joined the A's. Bob Walk. There's a Pedro Guerrera. And we've got an Andy Pettit from 2002. That's cool to see. And I'm trying to see what this... Home Team Advantage. I don't know what the Home Team Advantage card is. Tino Martinez... Mark Loretta. It's cool to see that product because I haven't seen a lot of it. We'd want to get a pool holes or an Ichiro out of that. Braves versus Phillies. America United We Stand. Veteran Stadium, September 17th, 2001. That's a cool card. Tops. That's a pretty cool card. Something I've not seen before. Very cool. Alfredo Simon. And a Jack Clark, kind of a pop-out. What is that from? Leaf, 88 Leaf. So that is probably the worst Fairfield box that I've ever opened. I don't even think there's anything in 90 Fleer that's going to uh, make it any better. Daryl Hamilton. There's a Joey Bell. And that is his rookie card. Joey Bell. Nobody interesting there. Dwayne Ward. Jack Howell. Jeff Russell. There's a George Brett. I'm going to pull that aside for Paul C., who collects him. Rick Honeycutt. Mark Langston. Lenny Harris. Lloyd McClendon. No. Ken Oberkfell. John Morris. Jeff Blauser. And Juan Augusto again. So... Some of those can be fun. That one just had too much uh, score and 87 tops to really get me going. But, you know, the George Brett is good. The Joey Bell rookie card. That card is probably my favorite just because I've not seen it before. I doubt it has much of a value, but very cool. And it was nice to see these 2002 tops. Andy Pettit, Tino Martinez. We got Eck and Bo Jackson. So hopefully the next one will be a lot better. Let me know, have you guys gotten some pretty bad Fairfield boxes like that? I've been, I guess I've just been pretty lucky in some of my earlier uh, Fairfield boxes to get some pretty decent cards from the random cards. These random cards were pretty bad. But uh, let me know in the comments how you guys have found Fairfield. I've got another one here that we'll do later. And you can see it's got uh, Ortiz on the front. But it looks like the exact same pack there. Uh, Fleer pack. So that's probably what we're going to see when we get to that one. So stay tuned. Hopefully we can turn our luck around and we'll see you guys tomorrow in the live stream. Everyone have a good night. See ya.